clear signs that you are in fifth dimensional consciousness. Hey my friends, welcome back to Attract Passion. Today we will be talking about signs that you are in fifth dimensional consciousness. So firstly, what is fifth dimensional consciousness? It's a state of being when we become aware that the reality that we are experiencing is not the only reality, it's just one version of infinite different realities. With our choice that we choose which reality we want to experience, with our thoughts, emotions and actions, we are choosing the potentials which will appear to us as a manifestation of our conscious choice. The first sign that you are in fifth dimensional consciousness is that you're not feeling separated anymore. As in third dimension, many people are feeling separated from everything. For example, we are dreaming about something and most people say, well, it's not possible for me. Look at where I am right now. I don't have no money. I'm sick or whatever it is. And my dreams, yeah, well, it's not possible. In fifth dimensional consciousness, we see, well, I will, I will create it because I'm not separated from it. Actually, I am the source of it. Also, when we are walking in the nature, we feel the connection with everything. For example, you're looking at a tree and you feel connected with the tree. You feel life inside the tree, the same life that you feel within you. And when you are observing people around you, you feel deeply connected with everyone. And I don't mean mentally connected or something. I mean connected by soul. Like... You would understand that we are all soul brothers and sisters and we are all in this together. So if I will create something, I want to create something which can be helpful for everyone in this community. The second sign is that you're always choosing heart over mind. Of course, our mind is a powerful tool for creating, for thinking, for receiving productive and creative ideas but heart always knows what is best for us with our mind we can create anything we can create something which can be beneficial for humanity or we can create something which can be negative for humanity but heart always knows what is best to create so it can be truly beneficial to all. So a person which is in fifth dimensional consciousness is less person but more consciousness and consciousness is higher energy. We can call it love because love is all about connection. Love is all about caring for everything. Love is about unity. Creative energy is coming from love and That's the source which is inspiring anyone who is in fifth dimensional consciousness. The third sign is that you're not identified by ego anymore, but rather by your soul or light being. So when we're identifying ourselves by ego, we want to prove something to others. We want to show up. We want to like show how good we are or whatever but when we are identified by soul we don't need to show anything all we care is that we feel good about ourselves and that we can provide something so also other people can feel good about themselves because at the deep core we are all equal so when we identify ourselves as a soul or a light being It creates a powerful effect on community because we are all equal. We are all the same. The light is shining bright within each of us. So we don't need any ego identification anymore because we are much more than that. Also, soul is all about creating, not showing up, not proving something, but just playing, creating and doing what you love so when we identify ourselves as a soul we don't care what people think about us because all we care is how to have 
as much fun with what we are doing as possible. And we understand from that perspective, this is the energy of abundance. Having fun and seeing beauty in everything is the energy of abundance. When soul is vibrating in that energy, in coherence with mind and heart, also its reality will be a manifestation of that abundance. Which takes us to our fourth sign, which is you went from state of being in lack to a state of being in abundance. This is a huge shift because when we shift our state of being into being abundant, it means that everything around us will will have more meaning because already everything is in abundance. Otherwise, we would not be here. But the question is, can we see the abundance around us? The air we breathe, the water we drink, the food we eat, the sun when it's shining, the stars that we see in the sky, everything is in abundance. But everything is coming from the same source. And as I mentioned before, when we feel connected with everything, we feel that this force of abundance is giving life to everything and we just need to become aware of it because as soon as we become aware of it we start vibrating in it and when we start vibrating in abundance we start manifesting abundance more of the abundance more of the things which we describe as abundance by our choice the fifth sign is that you feel more joy and gratitude in your life. So whatever is going on, maybe you're still facing with certain challenges or whatever it is, you feel joy for it. You feel gratitude for it because you know that everything is connected. So it doesn't matter how hard certain situation can be. You know that it happened for a reason. So you can evolve onto a greater level of yourself. So all you feel is joy and gratitude. But don't worry if sometimes you fall off that track. We still sometimes lose the sense of it and we feel fear, we feel anger, we feel anxiety or whatever it is. But soon we catch ourselves in the states and we bring up joy again and gratitude. The next sign is that you're seeing connection between events in your life. This one is again powerful. As I mentioned before, when certain things are happening in your life, you see the connection. Okay, I know why it happened. I know what will happen if I will do this. So we see the cause and effect in our lives. And whatever is happening on the world, we can see the connection between what we were doing in the past what is happening now and what can we do today so we can create this kind of effects for the future. A person which is in fifth dimensional consciousness will always be aware that we need to do something today that can improve our future. We are not waiting that the future will happen and something magical will change in our lives, but rather we will create small shifts today so that magic can appear as a manifestation of our actions. So this is it for today, my friend, science that you are in fifth dimensional consciousness. I'm sending you love, power and blessings for your transformative journey. And I hope you've liked the painting that was presented to you today. The name of this painting is the moment of transformation. Maybe you've saw it before. It's about caterpillar transforming into a beautiful butterfly. And all of that is happening in a glimpse of a moment. As an observer in third dimensional reality, also time can slow down or speed up. Depends of how much focus we place into the present moment. So my message to you today is to see the present moment as the greatest opportunity to create something which can truly be beneficial to all. Be present, be conscious, 
but also be creative because all your actions are manifesting and designing future. So choose wisely because you can choose any kind of reality you want, but it's a matter of choice. So look within your heart and choose wisely what can be truly beneficial to all. So let your light shine, my friends, and see you soon. One love.